Hello everyone, I'm Cryptic Fox, and a happy Monday evening. Hope everyone had a wonderful start to the week. Checking out a new game tonight. This is Forever Skies. The game actually comes out on the Thursday, the 22nd, I believe that is. Uh, so June 22nd, it'll be available on Steam. I actually have a link in the description if you want to check the game out for yourself. Uh, you can find it there. Uh, but we got to access the game a couple days early, so big thanks to the developer for providing me with a key so that we could uh, take a little peek at this ahead of time. Should be fun. Can have a little bit of uh, a little bit of fun and excitement. Checking out some new survival-y type stuff. So the general premise behind this game, if you haven't seen it before, is basically that uh, the world's come to an end, and we're in this like I don't know airship or something, like flying over top of the world. We have to like gather our resources and expand our ship and stuff from there but uh should be pretty fun uh welcome everyone who's here in the chat so far or if you're watching on the channel afterwards welcome as well as always a huge thanks to everyone who's clicked on the join button to become a channel member and help support the channel thank you all very very much and a special thanks to our top tier mistakes are made members that were highlighted at the start of the stream this game's something yeah they had the demo out some time ago but i didn't actually end up playing it i was going to and then i never got around to it so should be a good time i've been keeping an eye on this one for a while I'm a little excited for it to come out uh, of course, we have four different difficulty levels, including one that's permadeath. It's got a dead guy inside the suit. That would pretty much be me if I picked that level. So we're going to go with normal, I think, for now. Since I've never played before, we got to learn a little bit more about it. See how it all goes before I try to, like, throw myself into the deep end of the pool and just get uh, permadead. Because <laughs> I'm going to start all over. There will be no other end of the world. Chesla Milos, a song at the end of the world. Sweet Nevermore with a 27 month message. Ooh, I was hoping you'd try this one. Thanks, Fox. Yeah, I've been looking forward to this one. I've, I've kind of had my eye on it for a while. Um, I guess push to take and hold to consume things when I see them, it looks like. Welcome to, I guess this is Earth. Broken signal, lost expedition. Sagittarius 2 went silent for months, then this one signal in silence again. None of us know what awaits you there, but if there's a chance that they found the virus, then maybe we can survive. Find the virus sample at all costs. The fate of us all depends on you, the Ark. Items. Remains. First aid kit. Or that gives me 40 health, apparently. So that's a thing. Alright, so at the bottom left, we got our energy, our health, uh, food and water, because this is still a survival game. So uh, we have those standard survival-y type things. I gotta hold it to open. I get it. Oh! We arrived at the source of the signal. <laughs> Doors open. I hope they don't expect me to close it again later. For science, I kind of want to see if we can fall to our death right here. Still snow with the 56 month member message. Thanks for all the great family content. My daughter resubscribed. Careful with the hair. <laughs> Thanks, still snow. I have a helmet on in this game. You can't see my hair. Yes, you can. We can die here? Should we test it? No, we're not gonna test it. What do you guys think this is? What do you think this is? Well, there's not really... Not really good things left of the planet Earth, apparently. Health parameters low. Check the database for details. Health parameters low. Oh, I was losing health or something? What do we got here? Machine parts. Okay. We have parts for machines. Use computer? No power for the computer. Requires solid state battery. Ah, oh, dang it, we gotta invent new technology for this game. My airship got rocked. I gather I came in from orbit and they dropped me in on like a, a pod from somewhere in outer space or something. That's some strange looking debris there. Wow, okay. Uh, yeah, okay. Um, that's a helmet. Ooh, what's in here? More machine parts. <laughs> We're really good at finding machine parts, anyway. Dave with the super chat, but do it for science! Wally's down there somewhere, we gotta get him! Thanks for the super chats, Dave and uh, Dustin. Appreciate it. 
It's all gone to hell. Everything's been screwed up since we found this damn virus. We're all getting sick, equipment's breaking down, and then there's this Noah situation. Power blew out again, the door's locked. I'll check if the beacon tower has a compatible battery. To-do list. Oh, I see. Satisfy your hunger. Uh, okay. Power the computer. No blueprints. Nothing but machine parts. Oh, I got an oxygen tank, too. Additional oxygen tank, to, um, increasing its supply. Oh, wait. I have separate oxygen? Oh, crud. Is that what this blue bar is around the outside of here? Is that my oxygen? Oh, boy. This spells trouble. Take old canned water. Mmm, that sounds delish. Uh, let's just drink it. Oh, I, oh no, I took it. I did, uh, dang it. I meant to actually drink it. No, oh, well, whatever. It's fine. There's like an old spacesuit or something in here. Environmental suit. Do you remember the forests? I remember the sons of the forest. All right, well, there was a super chat. We got to go and check, check for signs what happens if we fall. I, hopefully, hopefully it just puts me right back where I was. <laughs> Banzai! Oh, okay, the impact hurts. <laughs> Uh, you traveled horizontally zero kilometers, vertically zero kilometers, day survived, one. Oh, it put- oh. Okay, it put me back in the pod. Sorry, everybody. I had to- I had to know. It was an important scientific research experiment we were conducting. That's- that's critical. I have less energy now, though. That sucks. Oh, wait a minute. Do I still have all the same stuff? I do! I don't have to re-loot. That's great. Oh, uh, Crater, with the 8-month member message, find a weapon first. A weapon first? Before what, before I jump to my death? That seems like a strange thing to tell me to do. I'm confused by this. Alright, I guess we're going up. Oh. Uh, Sun Melon. Well, let's eat that thing. Oh! Oh, God, I'm irradiated! I should have known that would happen. <laughs> You ate the melon too, didn't you? Sucker. Well, let's just take the sun melons. Maybe I can do something with them later. Uh, what do we got here? Take solid state battery. There we go. Alright, I can drop a little distance as well, hurt myself. That's good. Insert solid state battery. Use the computer. Undelivered message! Lost expedition! We were down under the dust. We found the lab where they first analyzed the virus 400 years ago. That's when it all started going to hell. No one went crazy. That so-and-so stole the sample, our airship, and broke the radio. He just left us here to die. He's dangerous as all hell. Location of the samples at the overgrown greenhouse. The scientists lived there who studied flora from under the dust. If you want to get there, try visiting some radio towers and wind farms to get necessary devices. Be careful! This world's no this world no longer wants us. It's not a place for humans anymore. Expedition Sagittarius. Okay, machine parts. Parts of small disassembled machine. Well that seems awfully specific. Health parameters. Immunity circle. Determines how hard you suffer from viruses. Value depends on other health parameters. I guess this is my immunity circle here. Fatigue bar, maximum level of stamina, all right, regenerates when sleeping, okay, health bar, hunger and thirst bar are self-obvious. So this here is my immunity circle here. That affects my health parameters, whatever that means. Sun melon, 10 food, 5 water, minus 10 health, good times, it's edible. Photobia virus, fresh fruit with low calorie, uh, low calorie value, picked from bushes, they spoil quickly. First aid kit, old canned water, clean water, preserved by aluminum packaging, all right. Photophobia. Therapeutic nutrients, lecithin. Cure the virus to kill, uh, to fill the medicine list. Hmm. Looking directly in the sun causes visual disturbances and injuries. <laughs> oh. Okay, well don't stare at the sun, I guess. We've learned about photo photomophobia, Momoba. Uh, I think I saw a door back here somewhere, right? Yeah. Man, I have, like, no stamina. Oh, don't look at the sun! Don't look at the sun! Oh, I see. I ate the melon and I got photophobia. Oh, that sucks. <laughs> I thought I was just learning about photophobia. I don't... 
know why I didn't realize I actually had it. That's fun. That's lots of fun. Take old canned water. Old food rations. Yeah, let's eat that. What do we got here? No, it's madness. It's all because of this damn dust. No heard voices. He was mumbling about nature surviving everything, even the fall of the world. He said he knew what to do so we could return to Earth again. He wanted to help us to help him to follow the voices in his head. Lunatic. We locked him in the cell for his own good. But the bugger hid the extractor and ran off while everyone was asleep. Oh, convenient the guy's name was Noah when uh, the whole planet was getting destroyed. Okay. Oh. Oh! The airship! Hey! We found it! Okay, what else we got here? Empty bottle. Drink her bottled dirty water. Mmm, that sounds delish. Let's just bottle it. I, I, I imagine later on we can clean the dirty water, otherwise they wouldn't give it to us, I guess. Take fabricator? Place on your airship. Ooh. Position blocked. Does it matter where I put this on my airship? I guess back here is probably best. Just stick it right in the middle and then hopefully it doesn't take up too much room. Ooh, oh, look at that stuff I got. Deck extractor, we got a bed, simple insect lure, insect catcher, other things I didn't read in time. Where do I cure myself of photophobia? Airship to-do list, lost expedition. I've been building a new airship for two months since that bugger Noah got away with our equipment. If only my workshop hadn't collapsed, I would have already had the airship engine research completed. So we have to place the rudder, place the fabricator. I just placed the fabricator. Uh, craft the deck extractor. Extract the wall blocking the workshop. Get the research station. Expand the airship. Not yet. Need resources from further locations, apparently. So we got a transformer. I wonder if it's Optimus Prime. As long as it's not a Decepticon. Those guys aren't nice. More canned water. Is that a Frisbee? It's not a Frisbee. Or if it is a Frisbee, they won't let me have it. Simple insect lure. I know I could read that thing, but I want to pick things up first. Food. More machine parts. Oh, condenser membrane. Okay. Alright, what do we got here? Photophobia virus research. My research on photophobia virus has shown that it can be cured with lecithin. Best found in dust moths and other things living in, in dust layers. Uh, I prepared a lure to attract these objects. Use it with the insect catcher on the airship. Lower into the dust and wait for the catch. The food from this world eaten raw may be harmful. I'll leave a membrane Hydration for the water condenser just in case some water will be needed to cook the food. Oh. That's cool. So we gotta like dangle a bug catcher down into the dust in order to catch the bugs we need to cure myself. That's fun. Okay, I can't bottle any more dirty water. That's that's maxed out. Hmm. Okay, well I got the bug catcher there at least. Um, can I crouch and go through here? No, I can't. There's definitely stuff in there. Oh, I got to take that wall apart. I think that's what they said with the extractor thing, right? <laughs> Okay, so this thing here is the lure con thing. So, open lure container. We want to put the simple ex insect lure. Next basic catch of the dust. Okay. Then we want to do things. Lower the lure. How do I do? Oh, lower the lure. There we go. <laughs> That's kind of cool. Okay. Check back in a while to see what was caught. All right, so we can't do that right now. Um, basic fabricator. We need the deck extractor. I have everything I need for that, so let's craft that thing. Uh, 
Printing completed. Printing completed. Ooh, it's a big one. Uh, I guess we put it out here. I'm assuming. Oh, I caught something. It's like bobbing around. Uh, all right, hold on, hold on. Put that down. How do I raise the lure? Ooh, that's a big moth right there, baby. Take dust moth. Okay. Eat what's caught to cure photophobia. <laughs> Ew, I'm eating a duh, all right. The virus was neutralized. Sweet. All right. Extract the obstacle blocking the entrance to the workshop. So this is our extractor. It's good for extracting things. Oh, jeez, I vaporized that sucker. Do I get something when I do that? Converts environmental elements such as walls and flying debris into resources. All right, well, I'll take the debris. Give me all the good stuff. This may not be the stuff I'm supposed to get, but I want it all anyway. Hopefully I don't have an energy limit. <laughs> That'd be just like me to waste all my resources doing this. Oh, I see on the left there I'm getting metals and stuff. Synthetics. All right, that's cool. I can I can extract things faster than the Mars drill. Yeah, fortunately. Okay, what do we got here? Take the solid state battery. I've got a couple of those now. Blueprint research. I managed to repair the research station. There are a few old blueprints preserved in the memory card, but the most important one is the scanner. It's necessary to complete its research. Uh, it's necessary to complete its research and craft it. After that, it should scan certain objects in the world so you can acquire more data for blueprint research. I need a battery to run the device. So I got this old power box in the ruins. There should be some batteries inside. Okay, well I got the batteries. Now where do I plug in the research magicinator? Oh, here we go. Take research station. Oh, it's mine now. Uh, okay, we got we've got research. Place on airship. My goodness, where does... Okay, I regret my placement of the fabricator now. <laughs> okay, hold on. Can I put this... I literally can't put this anywhere. Oh god, please tell me I can move these things. Q, pick up. Okay, good. Uh, pick this up. There we go. <laughs> I was worried I was going to be stuck with that thing in the middle. That would have sucked. Dust up with the super chat. My wife is telling me, checks your piece. Take it all. All of it. Every last bit of it. Board 11. <laughs> yep, yeah, we got to take it all. Take it all. Take everything. Use research station. Okay, so they said to research the scanner, right? I thought they said the research was almost done, but it says 0%. Oh, that's cool. Oh, this thing's cool. I like that. Mind you, I'm easily amused, so, you know. Uh, and I guess we gotta fabricate it? Yes, we do. Get fabricated. Printing completed. Oh, ooh, I got a scanner now. Uh, new objects requiring scanning. Studies menu. Hold tab to see more. Okay, so we've got research station. Repair patch, empty bottle, machine parts. We've got the scanner. Synthetic clusters, communicate communications facility ruins. I don't really know what I'm doing with this thing just yet. Oh, it literally... A scan to thing. Dirty water container. Empty bottle. All right. What else can I scanify here? It sort of like narrowed in when there was something I could scan in front of it. Is 
Synthetic cluster. Okay, so I scanned the thing I was supposed to. Didn't even realize it, but I did it. That's the best kind of quest objective. Finishing things that I didn't even know what I was supposed to do. Uh, take old isotonic drink. Let's scan this thing. Oh, God, I'm going to dehydrate. Um... Isotonic drink gives me what? Reduces fatigue, partially regenerates energy bar. Five water, fifteen energy. Well, let's uh let's go ahead and use that. And we'll use some canned water, because nothing says deliciousness like canned water. Take a poster. You nature. Alright. Already scanned that thing. Sorry, I'm trying to make sure I don't miss something here at the beginning that might actually be useful later. <laughs> even though I don't even know if it'll even let me. Research engine and fuel. Okay. Russ with a super chat. Yay, he did a thing. Look at that. I can do stuffs. I can do a thing like me. Uh, that's the wrong thing. I gotta go here. Um, what did it say? Research something? <laughs> engine and fuel. There we go. Don't forget to go back to the locked door with your batteries. Wait, locked door? What locked door? Research finalized. Research finalized. Synthetic fuel. I got a new blueprint. Can I scan the battery, the bodies? Oh, I can scan them. Engineer's body. He was in charge of operating and maintaining equipment. He designed devices uh, and adapted the resources and components he found for use. Well, good job, Engineer. Your work may have saved future generations of lazy people like me who just didn't want to do the work ourselves. Biologist body. His job was to collect and study biological samples. He was the one who was supposed to find a cure for the virus that threatens us all. Well, he didn't do a very good job. Noah's drawings. Noah's drawings from when he was locked in the cell by fellow, uh, in a cell by fellow his members of the expedition. Oh, I think that's a weird translation thing. Humanity, technology, and nature combined and blend together in all these paintings. I mean, they're kind of cool, actually. Cool eye. Uh, canned water is better than water from the can. Yeah. Uh, yes. Y yes. I I agree with you. <laughs> no one wants to drink water that came from the can. Expedition computer. Sagittarius two expedition computer. The source of the transmitted rescue signal. It needs power to operate. Well, we took care of that, didn't we? Nope. Oh, missed the component there. Oh, there's something back here. Metal components. Get that with the deck extractor, but pretty sure I can't reach that where it is right now. Can't scan these plants. Navigator's body. His mission was to map out directions and find resources even this far from home. He didn't do a very good job, so they killed him. <laughs> He's been dead for nearly two months. The decomposition process was slowed by Clem... Uh, like climatic climatic conditions. Actually, with the super chat, just got here. Please jump one time for me. Actually, I already jumped one time. You missed it. You have to scroll back. <laughs> I jumped off the side on purpose just to see, you know, what would happen. Turns out you die. It's funny how that works. Uh, let's go back and see if there's something I can scan back at the. Uh... Oh, I got here. Again. Again. Again and again and again. Synthetic case. Small resource. Yeah, whatever. So once I go to the locked door, but I don't see a locked door here anywhere. Uh, this guy's in as good a shape as I am. He has winded just walking across the floor. Uh, nothing scannable in here. Okay, I guess we'll go back to the ship and actually do what we're supposed to do now. 
After we satisfy what Ashley needs of us, hold on. Metal scaffolding. Banzai! Oh, oh man, you don't even get to fall all the way down. Hey, look, I reset my, uh, my, my food and water and everything. Okay, so, in this game, when you die, I have it set on normal, so I lose something like 20% of the resources that I gathered each time I die. So, you're welcome, Ashley. I sacrificed 20% of my resources so that you could see me not even really go splat. I just sort of, like, disintegrated halfway down kind of thing. You're welcome. You don't have to say it, you're welcome, craft an engine. I wonder if I have enough supplies now that I just sacrificed 20% of them. <laughs> uh, ooh, water purifier. We got uh, things. Electric cooker. We got a bed. Engine. Why does one of your mods find such joy in your death? I don't know, there's just a certain... There's a certain trend we have on my channel where I'm supposed to die in video games and Ashley reaps untold amounts of joy from it. Why is it not finishing? Did I not have enough materials? I want to put this picture up. Position blocked. Boop, there we go. I've got inspirational drawings. This, oh, pick up. This isn't working. Uh, Houston, we have a problem. I'm a good sport. Eh, it's only a game. <laughs> I don't take life too seriously, and I don't take games any serious, any more seriously. Let's see. Oh wow, that took forever. All right, we have. Oh oh oh. Hi, I have an engine. Can I put it on the back? Calories level is decreasing. Oh, calories level you right in the face. Okay, so it can stick on the on the frames or whatever. Let's put it up here. Maximum Boop. flight speed increased. Yeah, darn right, maximum flight speed increased. Now what I gotta do? Craft synthetic fuel. Oh no! Used to have a problem. Low efficiency fuel. Short usage time. Okay, I wonder if uh, I wonder if my death uh, resulted in this problem. <laughs> <laughs> Ashton was super chat. Well, you earned a like. Worth it, right? That's right. I I just pimp myself out for your for your your like button clicks. <laughs> um. Well, now we have a problem, and it's all Ashley's fault. I wonder if I can make this airship move before I finish doing everything it's told me to do, because I don't have enough synthetics to get what I need. Think about placement because you'll need to expand the airship. I'm trying to think about placement, but I mean, I've got limited places to think about placement right now. Want to get metal for that? Oh, wait, I can blast those synthetic things that are flying around. If I can actually get one in my field of view, that'd be great. That was metal. Synthetics, nice. Okay, so those give those those give more synthetics than those little containers did. So that that actually works out all right. Okay, that might be enough. Might be enough to make the fuel now. Still wasn't. Dang it! I'm one short. Give me a synthetic. Ooh, just barely got that one. Okay. Fuel. We did a thing. Yeah, we can move stuff around. I, I did stick things in a weird place to begin with, but uh, we'll expand the airship and it'll give us more more room to do stuff. Like, right now, I don't have a lot of space for much of anything. Synthetic fuel. Refuel the engine with the synthetic fuel. Uh, open fuel tank. Move. Quick move. There we go. There we go. Finish building the airship and then we gotta depart from here. 
What's this thing? Add condenser membrane. Ooh. Yeah. All right. I knew I was supposed to do that. That was totally planned. So that's going to do some condensing for me to make water. And then... So I don't need to research that since I kind of already have one. Although it would give me access to making the membrane. Plastic scrap I need for that. Repair patch. Eh, whatever. We'll deal with those things later. Okay, let's set, set sail. Control the ship. Speed heading. Lock speed. Let her rip. Hydration level is decreasing. Uh, fly to the source of the single flashing light. Oh boy, this is craziness. Which way is up and which way is down? Uh, okay. shift, is, shift is up, I guess. Maybe I can't go any higher than this. Lock speed. Okay, so that's locked in. Except it wasn't. I tried to I tried to back up and it didn't like it. The heck, man. Okay, now I got it. Ah, oh, sweet. Okay, so while it's doing that, I can come out here and blast things. Give me more resources. Maybe I should aim for ones that are a little closer. <laughs> That's cool. Out of range, huh? Out of range, my butt. Mombazoo is on sale right now. So if you want a game where you eat maple syrup and poutine, here's the time to grab it. <laughs> I've seen that game. It does look like something I would find interesting, but I just don't know where I'll find the time to play it. It's been out for a while now, huh? Wait, why is there two lights there? It was sending me to go to the single one. Fly to the source of the single flashing light, but there's two of them over there. Am I going to the wrong spot? Oh my god, I'm collapsing a whole building! Sorry! I don't know whose that was. It's not yours anymore, just saying. Oh god, I feel like I'm gonna crash into this stuff, but I, I can't make my ship go up. I think I might already be at max altitude. I hope this debris doesn't damage my ship. Go for a swim. It's not water, though. It, it would just be like falling to my death. That's not... That's not conducive to living. You know, falling to your death. Land on the location with a single beep, flashing light. Beep, beep, beep. What? Beep, beep, what? What the... What? Fuel depleted in one of the engines. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. <laughs> uh... I may not have placed my engine where I could reach it. <laughs> that, that might be a problem. Printing completed. Your ship can get damaged. Yeah, it was a weather could get damaged, but I'm just hoping it's not from... Oh, there we go. Nope. Don't fall, please. This is a really bad way to refuel your ship, just for the record. Yeah, that's the wrong thing. There we go. Fuel tank is full. We're underway again. Bob's your uncle. Or possibly your aunt. I don't know. I don't judge. Beep, beep. There we go. I should probably steer which way I'm going here. Max altitude. Uh, I guess I'm at max. Doesn't look like it though. Doesn't feel like I'm at max altitude. What's this game about? Basically, the Earth has been destroyed, and we're now back on the 
the surface of the planet, but we're not, well, I guess not really on the surface. We're flying above the surface of the planet, the and... Is decreasing. Vulnerability to viruses rises. Wait, what? How do I fix my immunity? Can I not close my doors? I feel like I should be able to close my doors. It's the max for now. I see, I see. Uh, unlock? Where am I going to land this thing? I guess just here? We've arrived! Drink dirty water. Oh, that sounds great. Uh, let's not do that. Um, rotten food. Consumption not recommended. It's past its shelf life. Oh, crap. It really did spoil fast. Old canned water. Let's go ahead and drink that. Machine parts. Old food ration. We'll chomp down on some of that, too, I guess. I gotta get rid of this food. We'll leave it here. Uncharted area. The preliminary analysis started. Communications point. Hold tab to see Analysis more. Completed. Detected new objects requiring scanning. Towers used to maintain communication between distant points. They also helped airships safely navigate through space, a potential source of basic resources and device blueprints. Communication point is a standard tower. Several shreds, uh, so, sorry, several sheds serve as temporary shelter for operators. Proximity to the dust pollution reportedly caused people to lose their minds. They saw strange shapes and heard voices coming from the dust. Oh, great. Fabulous. Just what I wanted to do. Go insane. Hey, look, it's a YouTube play button. No. It. Uh, wrecked basic turbine increases the flight altitude of the airship. The effect multiplies for additional building units built. Okay. Got electric elements. Solid state battery. Expand the airship. Time to hold. Uh, wait, what's this going on here? Moth Swarm. Threats. Moths forage in large groups to ensure their safety. Individuals separate from the flock to search for food and return when their hunger is satisfied. Interesting. Hydration level is decreasing. Oh, your hydration level is decreasing. Also mine. Oh, plastic scrap. Nice. That needs the deck thing to nuke it. That's the rotten food I tried to throw away, but didn't do very well successfully. I have no energy now. This sucks. I gotta, I gotta make a bed so I can get some energy back. Looks like I need to drop down in order to climb up there. We already found out if you can fall off the airship. Um, we can we can definitely fall. Yes, I've uh, I've already fallen a couple times just to prove that we could fall. <laughs> Every time you fall, uh, I'm on I'm playing a normal level, so each time I fall, I lose uh, I lose twenty percent of the resources that I've collected, which is uh, kind of crappy. Another insect lure. Couple repair patches, nice. There's lots of stuff in here, at least. What kinds of junk? What's this thing say? Uh, cockpit requires airship builder. Oh, I can put a separate cockpit on. That's handy. Mind you, it has a cockpit now. I just maybe not the one I need. Glass component. That's extracted with the deck extractor. Fox the last to live. I mean, I think everybody else is just supposed to be in space or something. I, th I think that's what the deal is. They evacuated to space so they could get above the planet. Get away from all this nastiness. And I don't know whether the intention is that we're supposed to find a cure or we're just like... I, I don't know what the underlying story is here. 
know we need to survive. That's a thing I know. Going up there did nothing for me, for the record. Uh, nothing else scannable in here. Alright. More to explore. I wonder how far I can fall before I take damage. Eh, pretty far. Make sure to research that plastic. What, like scan it, you mean? I can't. All I can do is pick it up. It's just a raw resource. So it seems. Can't get in there. I think I might be able to blast a hole in it, though. Yeah, if I had my if I back up the airship, I could take a blast of this thing and open it up. Immunity is decreasing. Vulnerability to viruses rises. Oh man, my immunity's sucking right now. Yeah, there's as much of this plastic as we can get, I guess. All right, I want to uh, I want to get in there, so I'm gonna have to back up the airship so I can blast that thing. Uh oh. Oh good, I can I can hit the button E to climb on board. <laughs> hey, we're in. Okay. Back this puppy up. Where was that building? Now we can get in. Hopefully. Actually, I still don't see an opening there. Okay. Try lowering my altitude. Okay, I can lower. That's good. Look at that skill right there. I'm a natural born captain, except I still can't get in here. Oh, wait, there we go. Well, that was a lot of effort for a couple of electronics, but beggars can't be choosers, I guess. All aboard! All right, research uh, research the airship builder. Find a location with double flashing lights. Well, I mean, there's a couple of them. I guess well, I see one that's closer anyway. Uh, airship builder. Find 17 cartridges labeled ET. <laughs> Those things just won't die. Okay, I assume I need to make that in the Fabricator. Water purifier. Purifies dirty water and of contaminants. The water becomes safe to drink. I'm making one of those. I can use some water that's safe to drink. I'm a guy like me who likes water that's safe to drink. Yeah, it was definitely it was definitely Atari. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty sure I had that game. Printing completed. Got some glass from over there. Okay, I've got to get rest. I got to make a bed, I guess. Um, I guess this will fit anywhere here, so that's good. 
boop. Add dirty water. Purification in process. Okay, let's uh, see. The bed requires synthetics. I gotta get more synth. I need more synth all. Hopefully the bed's not too big. Plastic at the research table. Hard to find, uh, and you can make it there. Oh, plastic scrap. Yeah, yeah. Ooh, look at that nice clean water it's making. Printing completed. Research finalized. Oh my god, the bed's huge. <laughs> Uh. Ah! I did it. Dehydration. Critical condition. Oh. Uh. Bottle of clean water. Okay, let's. There's clean water. Oh, it makes multiple bottles of it too. That's nice. Okay, food is gonna be the real problem here. I got synthetic fuel. I got glass, metals, machine parts. Where does one get more fuel or more food? I wonder. A football. No practical use. Could have been an object of <laughs> worship. Yeah. Okay, I want to use this football. How do I use the football? Literally just a decorative item. Alright, I got a football. <laughs> We're all ready for the gridiron now. Basic turbine, note sticker, machine parts. How do I get food? Food, I have to catch it, do I? Risk of starvation fatigue. Rest is recommended. Oh wait, no, I didn't I didn't put a lure in there. I don't think. Oh maybe it just has the other one that was already in there. Oh it does. Simple insect lure. Track space okay. Track elements. Alright. I guess we just lower it. I gotta rest soon, but I need to eat first. Kinda has Subnautica vibes. Yeah, it's got a little bit of a uh, couple things going on. It's got uh, a little bit of Subnautica feel to it. It's got a little bit of a raft feel to it, and that you're like building the building the vessel you're existing on, sort of thing. Uh, requires a bottle. Huh. Requires dirty water. Wow, I really emptied all the dirty water already. What the heck is that? Dust lettuce? Okay. Photophobia. Oh good, I got photophobia again. Eh, just what I wanted. Lettuce like vegetable was spread leaves carried to the wind. Uh, ten food and ten health. Alright. This is, this is kind of cool. How about paying back those equalization payments? Oh my god. Wasn't Synth the name of the drug in the space movie Outland starring Sean Connery? Oh, maybe. I was thinking like Synthahol, like in, uh, in Star Wars, or Star Trek rather. Okay, that's empty now, so we gotta put another lure in there. <laughs> Yummy dust lettuce. I don't know if I, I must have seen Olin, but I don't really remember it. Make a cooking station and cook the lettuce. Uh, oh, that's maybe not a bad idea. Uh, electric cooker. I need I need more synthetics again. It's always the synthetics. I'm just gonna I'm gonna sleep. I've got a little bit of food on me. <laughs> Alright. Starvation imminent, but at least I got I got a kind of fusees. I need to get a little bit more of the syn synthetic stuff. Okay, now I should be able to make the cooker.
Take a good look around and uh, take your time. You might miss important stuff. Well, I'm certainly going to miss important stuff. It's my trademark. My trademark and my speciality. Uh, let's learn how to make those membranes. I need more synthetics. Printing completed. Okay, electric cooker acquired. I guess we'll put that over here by the water thing. No, maybe not. <laughs> Finding places for things is getting to be a problem already. Use cooking station. So, ingredient slot, water. Oh, it takes water to cook things. Uh... Alright, water. Ingredient. Boil that sucker. Give me something good. Please give me something good. Note sticker. Electric elements. Set of electrical components packed in a shockproof case. Oh, those are the things that I picked up. I can research. Okay. Let's research empty bottle. I'm going to need that. Can't even get dirty water without it. Research finalized. You finalize your research. It's a research machine parts too. So I guess as we, the materials we find, we have to research and that will give us information and more things we can make. Research finalized. And then also there's just more like broad concept plans that we can research. Uh, electric elements. Okay, so we've got boiled dust lettuce. That, that's What does that do for me? 20 food and 25 health. That's pretty good. Still not enough, but it's good. Um, he used a lot of water, though, which and now I don't have any of, so that's good. I guess we'll just eat the dust lettuce straight. Photophobia. Um, dust mod, dust lettuce, boiled dust lettuce. So I, I'm cured, right? Yeah, I'm cured. I'm a cured guy like me. Outland synopsis. Workers are committing suicide. Sean Connery investigates to find they were taking a synthetic drug that made them more productive. Uh oh. see. I see. Let's get this ship underway so we can try to get to where we need to go. Can't go any higher than this right now. So I, got, I probably should dodge around these objects instead of flying straight into them. Even though that's, you know, that's not really in my wheelhouse. Alright, speed and stuff is locked. I think we can harvest back here. There is, but I can't quite get a shot at it. I got something. I got some metal or something. Oh my god, this is so crazy to look at. Make my eyes bug out. Out of range. So this platform's too high. I can't even go that high. Oh wait, I know what it is. Uh, hold on a second. I need to research the thing that'll let me go higher, right? This uh, basic turbine. Increases flight altitude of the airship. Was this an early access years ago? I know I played it before. No, they had a demo that was out quite some time ago. Oh, my internet's going all poopy. That's a technical term. Basic turbine. I'm oh, good, I have enough stuff for it, too. Rumors that Operation Outland was the alien universe. Dun, dun, dun. Cut off part of the ship to lighten the load. <laughs> can we build it? Yes, we can. I wonder if my daughter's using the internet upstairs. 
shouldn't be enough to affect me. I've got high speed, but it's still looking not optimal right now. And all the good stuff's out of range. Hey, Jason. Maybe she has higher speed. Hold on a second. I'm going to run a quick internet speed test. This is uh, killing me here. I even reset my machine earlier. My speeds look fine. I don't know why it would be sucking the hind teat right now, to use a technical term. Uh, okay, where the heck do I put this thing? Houston, we have a problem. Uh, I gotta go back to a landing point. I think I gotta get out of the ship to like put that thing on. Gotta go back here. Now I'm flying the direction all these things are going. Let's make them easy targets. Well, it's never that one. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, God. R. Will those things hurt my ship, I wonder? Swords village and scatter whenever there's danger due to their poor eyesight it would be possible to catch them with the proper equipment. Oh I see. Alright. Uh this thing. Oh boy, it's huge. Maximum flight altitude increased. Okay. We got this. I need to make a condenser membrane. And a plastic bottle, too, would be nice. Printing completed. Printing completed. Okay. Dirty water acquired. Oh, so I got the bottle back this time. Last time I swore it, it consumed it, which is kind of weird. All right, let's try sleeping. <laughs> I'm low on food again, though. Or still? I guess still is probably a more accurate term there. Starvation. Critical condition. Starvation imminent. Okay. Maximum altitude's better. We can now navigate back to this thing. That's right, I'm doing a YouTube video from the future. The future! I still don't think I'm going high enough. I'm at max altitude again. Do I need two of those things? That's lame. Uh, oh, crap. That is definitely less than ideal. Sun's coming out. That's nice. It's almost pretty when the sun's out. You know, if you ignore the fact that it's a whole ruined society. Oh, actually, I might be high enough. I think I might be alright. See a little bit better now. Speed is locked in. We're gonna go barreling into the side of that sucker.
Oh, yeah, I got plenty of altitude. Wow, I felt like I was down too low when I was seeing that from a distance. Alright, we're good. It just, for some reason, from a distance, it looked like I was down too low, but uh, we're actually up higher than I need to be. Put her in right there, nice and gentle like. Oh, yeah, professional flying at its best. Or something. I'm gonna want to use this thing over here. Can't get a target. Oh, wait. Oh, uh, oh. Uh. Come on. There we go. Got you. That's a pretty small target you gotta aim at right there. Hydration level is decreasing. Quite with the hydration level, it's fine. Your hydration level. You're decreasing. I think that's not annoying. You know what? Forget it. We'll deal with it later. <laughs> that's really annoying. Uh, all right. Hydration levels are decreasing. Let's have a little risk of starvation. Oh, relax. Oh, I forgot to grab this thing. Okay, what can we cook in here? Let's uh, let's cook a moth. Cause why not? Boil that sucker. Oh, get the container out of there. That's why we didn't have enough containers. It was still in the cooking machine. <laughs> Standard wind farm. Improvised power plants built on high-rise steel structures produced electrical power for nearby districts. Source of copper, electronic resources, and helium. Standard wind farm is a typical power source that was built after the cataclysm. With time, due to the harsh conditions, electrical consumption was minimized. It slowly became a luxury available to only a few people. Doesn't look like it's available to anybody anymore. This is all busted. New studies to scan. Wrecked location radar. Helium. Copper. Circuit boards. Communications really completed. Alright. Oh, helium. There we go. Search helium fuel. I can take that. Yoink. How many containers of helium can one man carry, I wonder? If you craft the airship builder, you should be able to extend your airship. Yep. We'll do that. We'll make our airship bigger. -er. So those I gotta get with the blaster thing. The extractor. Means I'll have to turn the ship again. Another solid state battery. Nice. Hello you! I was gonna say, what can I drop in there? Uh, oh, circuit boards. Oh, look, it was a, uh, it was a crypto farm here. They're farming cryptocurrency. We just stole their, uh, their graphics card. You're welcome. <laughs> I guess I didn't need to nuke the door. I could just open it. I knew that, too. Surprisingly, nothing scannable in here, but we got uh, copper from the uh, stator or whatever. Uh, 
Were the helium tanks uh, where you missed the screen hanging up? Hint. There was a screen hanging up? Immunity is decreasing. Vulnerability to viruses rises. Your immunity is decreasing. Oh, I tried to look at that, but it just didn't... Didn't realize I could scan it. There we go. Rec location radar. Displays locations and navigation points. Alright. I'm about to starve to death. I hope that moth has finished cooking. It's so yellow green out there, it really is. Craziness. Uh, Alright, we got this finished. Alright, so, boiled dust moth gives me 40 food. Ooh. Liza's pardon. Took two water to cook it. That's interesting. Uh, let's research some... Oh, I can't research helium. That's interesting. Rainwater collector. Helium fuel. Let's research a storage box. Uh, okay, so the fabricator thingamabobber with the ship airship builder. There we go. Get one of those going. Insert solid state battery. Oh, I burned up the battery. Cool. It said it's food, didn't say it's good food. Yeah, fair enough. <laughs> fair enough. It's capable of feeding you, but just not tasting good. Rooms require a shipbuilder, catwalks, plastic walls, ladder rooms. Really? Build menu. What have we got here? Small cockpit, cockpit. Room, ladder room. Glass floors, doors, plastic walls, catwalks. Oh boy, those are huge. Cannot place outside, okay. Um, so that means I need rooms. It means I need more synthetics, of course. I should try to get some some of that copper that I saw too, actually. I need to turn the ship a bit though. That's better. Now we can get some copper. Hydration level is decreasing. Well, it gives me a warning at like half. It's not really that dangerous. We still got half left. That seem to be my problem a lot, so we'll get rid of a bunch storm of those. Is coming. Storm? What? Room. Oh! Oh! What happened to the stuff that was there? Oh, crap. Please tell me that that's somewhere now. Oh, it's in my inventory. I'll go here. I cannot place inside. Oh, so I need... I need to build a floor out here. Door, plastic wall, catwalk. Lightning strikes the highest targets. Low in altitude or seek cover. Oh boy. <laughs> Let's get out of here! Oh god! Oh, we've been hit! We've been hit! Ah, the glass is all busted! We gotta get, gotta get down, gotta get down! God dang! Alright, that... That doesn't look good. You know where repair... I gotta get those patch kit things, right? Where do you put those patches? Oh, they're there.
<laughs> it picks one up. I gotta make. Uh. Hmm. Shut up! Your immunity is decreasing. Oh, Jesus! Am I not low enough? What's going on here? How low can I go before I like start to die from like being down too low in the dust? Warning. Low altitude. Oh, shut up. There. All right, I need patch kits because I, um, I, I, a thing happened to the ship that was completely outside of my sphere of control. I, I, I can't make patch kits. Okay, well that's good. Perfect. Uh, where's the? There we go. Repair patch. <laughs> God, it just, like, really blasted me. At least it didn't wreck my poster. That would've sucked. What does that have? Uh, okay. Repair patches. Did that hit me again? Maybe I need to get underneath something. Are we okay now? I think I fixed everything. I think we're good. Maybe not. It's still a little smoldering out here. Why does it look smoldering? Oh, there we go. Okay. Need another one. There's resub. Oh, sorry, 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 sorry. Hold on. Uh, Denny Beauty, and this is why you're my fave. Oh, thanks, Denny and Beauty. Sorry, right, I wasn't paying attention. But thank you for the uh, 15 months of support. Amazing. All right, I gotta fix the inside here. All right, I think I think I fixed it all. I, th I think everything's you know, crisis averted. We're we're fine. Everything's fine. How are, how how are you? Are, are you fine? You're, you're, we're, we should all be fine. <sighs> I gotta make lures for this thing too. Uh, I need to research the storage box because I'm running out of storage room, and I need to get insect lures, and I need another cannot place inside. Put this out here. Slap that sucker inside. <laughs> I can see progress for me is going to be very slow in this game. <laughs> oh, God. Chat kill Fox, Chad wins. Using metal duct tape to repair with? Hey, listen, it's, it's a special kind of metal duct tape, okay? It's the patented, patent pending red green duct tape thing extractor extracts raw resources from a uh, short operating range so i have an extractor that's weird wait i can put one on my arm that's cool take dust moth cook dust moth either rinse repeat Need one of those condenser things. I can see this is going to be one of those games where there's just going to be a lot going on all the time. Research that. Why does this have like the X's on it? Is it because I can put like glass on here or something? Plastic wall, door, glass floor. Oh, I see. Yeah, I can. But I can't see through it if I put it on there. That that's kind of lame. I don't like that.
Platforms that had half. Oh, it is at half health. The one is anyway. That's weird. Two of them are. Okay. We keep some of those things handy. Printing completed. Uh, bloop. Wait, was that the boiled one? No, dust moth. Okay, good. Let's eat the boiled one. Oh, very nice. Okay. I need to sleep. <laughs> My guy has not really gotten a good rest yet. Okay. That was good. That was productive. That was productive sleep. Mars bottle. Um. All right. Probably should pop some more fuel in here if I can. <laughs> Why did I put that thing there? I can't even reach it. Open fuel tank. Oh, I'm down to nine. Oh boy, I'm gonna have a fuel problem. I need to make fuel. Where's the fuel? Where are the fuel at? There it is. Synthetic fuel. Get your guy a CPAP machine. <laughs> He's up, yeah. Darn right. Okay. Um, so I'm clearly gonna need to relocate that lifter thing. I should probably put it out on the side of the ship over here if we can land, and then I'll do the another room on the side here. That'll give me the space to build around behind here. Instead of the way I have this configured right now. Um, so where are we going to go right now? To-do list. Build a new wall on the airship. Uh, research and craft the location radar. Location radar, you say? I did see another two dot light area at one point. I don't know where it is now though. Oh, I need scrap plastics. Oh, dang it. Oh! Expand balloon, helium and stuff. Balloon core. Base for balloon. Each airship has at least one, but it's possible to add more parallel balloons to increase lift capacity. Oh, cool. Alright. Let's get this ship up here and moving again. I would like to... Blast some more of that copper while I'm here. that. I think that might have been glass. Nope, metal. Dang it. Uh, there was another turbine that I had gone inside, and there was some copper inside of it, but where was that? Oh, it's back there. Let's spin the ship again. I should put a, an extractor on both sides of the ship so I don't have this problem like having to move around. Okay, copper acquired. Um, so I finished that research. Oh, there's some like, fuel. We need to fuel up the ship here. Actually, let's lower this down so I can do some more work on it. Oop, too fast, too fast! 
Tuck it in slow there. Oh, I just scraped the bottom a little bit. We're just getting the barnacles off. It's fine. It's fine. Brian and Arden viewers just joined. Hey, Brian. Welcome to the stream. Thanks for popping in with the raid. Welcome anyone who might happen to be joining from Brian's stream. Uh, do I have an I don't have a water bottle left yet, do I? That's free. I can put that in there. And then we can use this to collect the water out here and purify it in here. Beauty. Raid! Good, bring the raid. We got giant moths in here, man. We're gonna need a little bit of bug power. Uh, I need to relocate this thing. Maximum flight altitude reduced. Oh, maximum flight altitude, you, right in the ear. Um, <laughs> can I not put these things on side? Oh, there we go. It's a little finicky. Maximum flight altitude increased. I like it. I want one on the other side, but for now, let's go ahead and make uh, let's make another room here. Oh shoot! I gotta move the engine. Um, pick, pick that up. Oh, turn it off. Wait, what? <laughs> I literally can't pick this thing up. Container not empty. Oh, I gotta empty the fuel. Okay. I got it. I got it. I'm a little. I'm a little slow. I'm a little slow. Maximum flight speed. Boot gang lit. Yeah, lots of people jumping in here. With boot gang. Welcome everybody. Uh, so here's the engine. We gotta stick this thing back on. These on the outside edge this time, where I can actually fuel them a little Maximum more easily. Flight speed increased. I'll end up putting multiples on here, I guess. Okay, I need catwalks up front here. Blocked by the environment. Oh, dang it. So what's the story? With the game? Uh, so the general premise is that the Earth has been destroyed. Uh, we've left the planet, and we're now returning to it, and we're trying to gather resources and see what we can... I don't know, see what we can recover here. So we're back on planet Earth, and this is what's left of it. It's a glorious place. Not the friendliest place to vacation. <laughs> it's, it's, it's had, uh, you know, it's had better days. It's had better days. But, uh, we're on this little airship thing that we've, that we've, uh, we've salvaged to fly around and gather additional resources and uh, uncover what we can find about the uh, the buggy things that are going on on the planet here. Um, where's the... Oh, there it is. I need, the, I need my extractor back on here. Stick this out here. There we go. So now I can... I can... No, it's out of range. That figures. Okay, we have that. Uh, I'd like a second engine, but I don't really have a lot of fuel, so that's problematic. Uh, I want to move this back here. Stick this way in the rear of the ship. That out of the road. Our fabricator... I don't know, whatever. Move the fabricator over here for now. So I do need to build a... Uh, plastic wall on this thing and for that quest. I need synthetics. Of course I need synthetics. Alright. We're off. Oh right, I turned the engine off, didn't I? <laughs> I gotta gotta fuel this thing up again. There we go. I saw a double flashing oh there it is. There's a flashing point out here. Wait, oh that's the one I came from already. Russ McKay with the Super Chat. I imagine this game would be a lot more fun on Mary Jane. Or a lot more confusing. I'm not sure which of the two it would be. Okay. In the fabricator... We should be able to make the... Uh, scanner thing now for navigating. There it is, location radar. Craft that sucker. I gotta craft a box too so I can store some things. 
Yeah, now I can access the engine from inside. I could before, too. It was just not a convenient reach, that's all. It was a bit problematic. Risk of starvation. Oh, starvation. What? I'm not gonna starve. We got plenty of food right now. Alright, plastic walls placed, so that's quest is done. We're, we're in the middle of crafting the uh, location radar, so that'll satisfy that one. I feel like I should have multiple crafting things, though. I gotta get some more lures so we can catch some more bugs to eat. Printing completed. Printing completed. Okay, location radar. Where do I put this thing, I wonder? Oh. Oh, I could literally put it on the... On the window. I, I want it to be accessible when I'm flying the ship, but I don't want it to block my field of view a whole bunch. Stick it. Oh, that's not even. I can't even read it there. <laughs> that's no use. Uh. All right, hold on. Maybe on the side would be better. It's gonna be weird because it's it's not gonna be in the direction that I'm facing. Let's see where this takes us here. Which way is the ship facing? Assuming it's where the arrows are pointing down there. Alright, so we've got uh, multiple directions we can go in. Oh, I see where it is. The top of the triangle there. Okay, so we're going to go this way. 1.58 kilometers. There's something out that way. Oh, good. We get to fly through a bunch of buildings. <laughs> Hopefully I don't smash my ship to pieces going through here. <laughs> Almost everyone loves Mary Jane. Last dance with Mary Jane. One more time to feel the pain. Or one more time to kill the pain, I guess it is? I don't know. I don't remember the song very well. I'm going to lock in the speed here so we can go and do some zapping on the way by. Look at that sucker. Ooh, look at all the metal we can gather over there. Oh, in here too. Can't hit that one though. Just barely hit enough. Oh crap! I wonder if I could drop the building on my airship if I do that from too close. That could be an issue. Stuff's all in a range. Uh, there's more of the twin lights over there. I can't even see what I'm flying towards. How far away am I now? 1.29 kilometers. Okay, I'm gonna uh, alter course here a little bit, I think. If we go this way, we can go out towards those gl those glowing lights there. We'll gather resources. Immunity is decreasing. Diseases might become more severe. Yeah, we'll go, we'll go hit up the double lights there before we go hit the uh, actual destination we're headed for. Uh, research transformer. Wait, what happened? Airship da damage debris. Floating debris is a threat to the. Oh, okay, that's a problem. What? what is, I guess it's this stuff here that constitutes the floating debris. Those little spinning chunks. The synthetic things I've seen break on the ship before already, and they didn't cause damage. Everybody who joined a little bit ago, you uh, you missed us getting struck by lightning. That was fun. I thought my whole ship was going to go down. <laughs> oh, wait. It's telling me to reach the uh, exclamation point on the radar. Where's that? Oh, I guess it's any one of them. All right. Is it single player? I missed some of the stream. Yeah, it is uh, it is single player. Uh, I don't know if there's an intention to make it multiplayer or not. I, I did see uh, one of the screenshots that the dev has in their press kit shows multiple players together. Hydration level is so increasing. it does kind of suggest that they intended for it to be multiplayer at some point, but uh, I haven't seen anything confirming whether that's the case or not. Unfortunately. Uh, I need to make more fuel. 
I also, I'm gonna make another fabricator. That's what I'm gonna make. This is ridiculous. Where's my fabricator? Water purifier, condenser, storage box. What the heck is the fabricator? Do I only get one fabricator? What the heck? Extractor, scanner, builder, repair patch. Huh. Oh, you know what? I picked up the fabricator. I didn't make it, did I? That's a shame. Alright, well, we gotta refuel. We'll get us going again. Plan on adding co-op after launch. Is what I've been seeing. Yeah, like I said, the uh, the, the the screenshot from the dev suggested that uh, suggested that there would be multiplayer, but uh, it's just not something you can do right now. The game comes out on the twenty second, which is like this Thursday, uh, but it'll be an early access launch on Steam. I have a link in the description if you want to check out the game on Steam. Your immunity is decreasing. I gotta get uh, some more food options here. I thought I researched the uh, advanced. I did research the advanced lure. How do I make it? Simple lure. What the heck is the advanced lure? I know I researched it. Oh, we'll make a simple one for now, I guess. I need that to increase my immunity again. Slap this in here. Advanced lure wasn't finished yet. It wasn't? I mean, I don't, it's not here. Motherboard extra. Oh, there it is. Oh, yeah. I ran out of plastics. That's right. Oh, jeez. Moths. Uh. Probably shouldn't crash into anything here. Last hint. The place with lights have an electrical box. Remove the battery to turn the lights off so you know where you've been. Oh, yeah. I have been grabbing the, uh. Thanks. I've been, I have been grabbing the batteries, but just because I saw them there, I figured they'd be useful. Kind of flew into the platform. Did that stop my? No, I still got it. Nice. Boil that sucker up so it's ready to go when we need it. This will give me more copper. Yeah, I gotta get some more plastics here on this uh, this platform so we can finish researching that advanced lure outside of range. All right, what do we got here? Let's get our scanner going. There's the electrical box over there. This looks like it might be the same layout as the last one. Need mock. Thanks for clicking the join button. Welcome to Duplicant. Appreciate the support. I have to start making helium fuel, I think. I wonder if it lasts longer than the other fuel does. Oops. We got mechanical parts in here. A data card. Uh, new blueprint, railing. Requires airship builder. Okay, so I can put railings on my ship now. More circuit boards. Taking over their crypto mining operation here. Old can of dirty water. Hmm. Actually, I think it was clean, but it was old still. You go faster on the healing field? Oh, is that what it is? All right, that's cool. I need to find plastics. I 
Nothing in here. Where can I find plastics here? Crypto was a big thing, yeah. <laughs> Old cryptocurrencies. They were using these big, uh, these big wind towers to power their cryptocurrency operation. But when the world ended, they decided maybe crypto wasn't worth going after anymore. There's no plastic on this whole, this whole tower. That sucks. So if you crash your grip, is that like a hindering situation or? Uh, you know, I, I don't really know. Oh, did my ship move? Feels like it moved a bit. Yeah, definitely no plastics here. This sucks. You can make it not all your research plastics. I did make I did research the plastics, but I didn't see where I could make it. Do I just can I just craft it in here? Hydration level is decreasing. Location radar. Oh, I can oh my god. I knew that. I was just testing to see if you knew it. That's what it was. I gotta make that storage box. Storage box first. We'll make other things with the plastic later. This thing's done. Inventory full. Yeah, definitely do that storage box. Oh crap! I have so many things. I literally actually I can drink this. That'll give me some energy, and then I'll free up a spot, which I'm definitely gonna need to put down my storage box. How big is this thing? Oh my god! There. Uh, I mean, it's it's not huge. Hopefully it's got some decent storage in it. Six slots of storage. All right. Machine parts. Uh, copper. I want to keep the basic materials on because I kind of I use those a lot. I probably shouldn't get rid of my uh, oxygen tank. <laughs> I have a feeling that's a necessity. Batteries, more plastics. All right, we're good on that front. Okay, so to finish the advanced lure, I need. Uh... No, I have enough plastics now. Nice. Better level fifty percent. Better the void train storage. Yeah, with void train storage, you only get four slot storage boxes, which is brutal. I mean, what are you gonna put in there? You basically empty the lint out of your pockets, and that's it. Okay, now we can make the advanced lure. Uh, I'm gonna make another storage box, though. I wonder if I can stack the storage boxes. That would be handy. No storage is better than void train storage. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> practically. Radio towers have plastics through the wind tower. Oh, the radio towers do. Okay. All right. That explains that, doesn't it? They are not stackable, apparently. That sucks. The batteries in here. Okay, where can we go now? Uh, I want to set. Can't help. How far away is that thing? Turbine damage. Max altitude is lowered. What? Ah, oh, crap. Uh, I got repair kit things here. Not require repair. Jeez, all kinds of stuff got damaged here. What's going on? Caution. A storm is coming. Oh crap, storm. Okay, let's get out of here. <laughs> we need to uh we need to get down low again. Before I have a repeat of the last incident.
Come on. I'd like to turn the ship around so I can at least see where the platform is. I'm gonna try and get underneath this thing if I can without wrecking my ship. Can't really move sideways though, I can only like turn. I can't get any lower than this right now. Oh god dang! Okay, I think they hit the tower. I think we're fine. Jeez. Do you drive this airship any better than you do in State of the Gate 2? No. No, definitely not. <laughs> I think it's safe to say that's that, that's a hard no. The storms are cool, but... That freaked me out a tiny bit. Okay. Advanced insect lure requires copper, plastic, scraps, and... S oh, sun melon I don't have on me. It's, uh, the one I had went bad. Another condenser. Maybe. There we go. Today's God is one of my man's top games. So good. It is good, yeah. I don't think there is an anchor. This game has some potential pretty rad so far. I like it, yeah. It's neat. Uh, we're still pretty early in the game, so I, there's a lot to be seen still, but uh, so far it's pretty cool. As long as we're standing here, we might as well get more metal. I need the storm to go away so I can get out from underneath these towers. Rainwater collector. Energy crystal? Where do I get energy crystal from? No, I need copper. Man. Research finalized. Okay, motherboard fabricator. Let's do the rainwater collector next. Get two copper again. No glass, so I gotta wait until I get some glass for that thing. I think the storm's ending. Yeah, okay, let's get underway. Uh, we're gonna try and go to this uh, exclamation point that's like. Well, that one's 2.7. Where's the one that was like 1. Point something away? Yeah. <laughs> Fuel depleted. Oh, good. Okay, I gotta make, uh... Gotta make helium fuel. Maybe. Low efficiency fuel, medium efficiency. Going that way. Lots of crazy storms on IRL in the southeast and midwest. Yeah. Our weather here's been weird too. I, I live in southern Ontario and it, it like this time of year it's normally hot, we getting into the summer weather. It's been reasonably cool here though. We've had a couple hot days, but it hasn't been like crazy, you know? It's just been like I don't know, kinda of mild. Okay, we're going hopefully that's the one I was thinking of. It doesn't have the distance marked on it anymore. It's gotta be that blue beacon out there. Immunity is decreasing. Diseases might become more severe. Your immunity is decreasing. Alright. 
Speed's locked in, let that do its thing. And make some more of that fuel, because I know we're gonna need it. Bugs. I was getting a little low on energy too. Not too hot but cool than usual. Yeah, it's been weird. Like we had the it was like uh, it was a really late start to the warmer weather to begin with. Oh, that was really loaded. Um, late start to the, to the warmer weather, and then we got like a couple hot days, and then it was like right back to cool days again. Not that I'm complaining too loudly, because I actually like when it's warm, but the air's got a bit of coolness to it. Stab normal is all. It's not the typical thing, you know? Do I have a plastic container? I don't. Let's make another plastic container. Another fancy dust moth. Oh, I'm out of water. There we go. Wait a second. I can get those towers down here and get some more metal. Why is my ship shaking just because that thing's falling? That makes no sense. Oh, I blocked the other piece. I can't get it. Oh, yes, I can. All right, we're fine. I was like, let's make that noise, but it's not with the water purifier. <sighs> Laidback Assassin with the super sticker. Thanks, Laidback Assassin. Appreciate the support. Very generous of you. Okay, tower's toast. Hit the wrong button. <sighs> Going this way. Who gave me a pilot's license? <laughs> I don't know, but whoever it was, they were not using their head. Turbine damage, max altitude is lowered. What? What happened to the turbine? It's at 90%, man. 90% should be good enough. In Dallas, he'll be at 100 with a heat advisor of 112. Yeah, it was uh, definitely not that hot here today. <laughs> I could have put on like a light sweater, I think, today when I was outside. I could have, I didn't, but could have. I want to see this big building fall down if I take these like metal parts out of it. Not because it will do anything useful for me, but just because I want to see it fall down. Oh, it's out of range still. Come on, we got this. This game looks cool. Yeah, I like it so far. It's uh, it's kind of it's, it's a little bit rafty, you know. It's it's not exactly like rap, but it's got some elements that remind me of it. A little bit, a uh, little bit of reminder stuff from uh, Subnautica too, to some extent. Come on, building, you gotta fall down. I flew over here. Oh, jeez. What the? What happened? <laughs> it was, God, scared the crap out of me. The building didn't fall, though. That's, that's lame. Oh, well. That was anticlimactic. Whatever the heck hit me, hit me hard. 
Oh, this tower's too high. I can't even get up that high, I don't think. Am I even moving? Oh, I'm going against the wind a bit. more repair kits. Okay, so this is too high. I can't get on there, but we can redirect to that little tower over there. That'll give me a place that we can build up another one of those uh, turbines to get us up higher. This poster's kind of in the way. <laughs> Let's put that back here. That's better. Now I can see. There is a lower platform there, but that's still still outside my height limit. Can they please change that sound? It's ridiculous. Which sound? The you're talking about like the blaster sound from the extractor or something else? Can you expand your balloon too? Yeah, you can actually. There's uh, there's two two ways you can make the balloon bigger. Uh, oh, actually, I don't have it in here. Somewhere, where was it? Oh, here we go. No, oh, that's flight stuff. Maybe it was in research. Yeah, here it is. So we can do balloon core, which lets us do like side by side balloons to make it uh, have better lift capacity, or we can expand the balloon. Which also increases the lift. It just makes the balloon bigger. Maybe I'll research that for now. We can make a bigger balloon. Uh, did I just overshoot the tower I was going for? I did. It's too busy looking at other things. I overshot. Let's right in here. We get some plastics while we're here. There we go. It's interesting. There's like stuff growing way up here too. As much as the spores or whatever, the dust or whatever they're calling it that's in the air isn't so good for us, it seems to be doing right for the plants. Oh, I, th I think I just got a lantern. I did get a lantern. That's handy. Tech lure repair patch, nice. Maybe you need to upgrade the balloon to fit another rotor. You think so? Alright. Could be, I mean, upgrading the balloon will increase the lift also. Uh, I just finished researching the balloon upgrade, so maybe we can... Uh... Well, if I go to this thing, where's the build menu? So I can expand the balloon with uh, copper machine parts and helium. Hopefully I have enough helium left. After I've made all that fuel out of it. Mistakes might have been made there.
Battery acquired. That's the important thing. Fatigue. Rest is recommended. Ah, oh, I gotta sleep again, man. Okay, let's see. Uh, let's see if we can get the size of the balloon bigger first here before I rest. Um. Okay, so we need uh, a total of four helium, twelve machine parts, and eight copper. Okay, and helium, and then uh, machine parts. I'm a little light on actually. Oh, there we go. Oh, what part of it does it make bigger? That's interesting. Oh! Oh, Jesus, just made it longer. Okay. <laughs> We've got a lot more room in the front now. <laughs> Alright. I did a thing. Go us. Have a little drink. We'll take a little nap, and then we'll uh, get out of here. Blue pill for the balloon. <laughs> it's something like that, anyway. <laughs> Remember, if you stay aloft for more than a few hours, call your doctor. Oh, what the? What happened to the lighting? It was always like greenish before. Now it's like, it's got more of a bluey tone. I want to see if I can put another turbine in this thing so I can get more lift still. Um, where do I, oh, I guess I gotta craft that thing in here, don't I? Basic turbine. Uh, five electric elements and five machine parts. Oh. There we go. Don't leave without sucking up the glass. Yeah, I gotta get some glass too. You gotta have to change my ship position to get a shot at it, though. She wants... Well, that thing's doing its thing. Let's see if we can get ourselves positioned in a way I can get a shot at some glass. The wind really pushed me around there. Completed. I only got a couple pieces of glass out of that. Jeez, look at the wind push me. Or is it my balloon bumping on something? Maybe my balloon. Oh yeah, it's my balloon. That thing sticks way out in front now. <laughs> Uh, it's gonna be hard to getting used to. Uh, I kind of wish I could pull that back and put it behind the ship instead. That might have been a mistake to put that up there. Is that one toward the front more or toward the back more? It's on the back one. That would be kind of symmetrical like, you know? Okay, so. Removal mode. If I removal it, does that mean... Oh, jeez. <laughs> I don't want to remove the whole freaking balloon. Come on. Alright. That's not adjustable now. That's great. I have this giant thing in my way up front all the time now. 
Check to see if you can research the glass. Uh, uh, that would be a no. I need it for the note sticker. Not that that's terribly useful. Alright, so with a bigger balloon and another turbine, I should be able to get high enough now. Yeah, <laughs> you have the same problem. Places new engine craft starts rising. Wouldn't that be a thing if it just let me standing on the tower there and just like took off? <laughs> like, ah, come back! Oh, this is gonna be close. I don't even. Uh, I'm gonna skim like just barely onto this platform. I'm at max altitude right now. Ooh, good thing I didn't have anything built underneath. I wouldn't have got on there. Okay, we're set. Get this thing going while I'm exploring. Risk of dehydration. You risk of dehydration yourself. And water. We'll drink that. Uncharted area. Uncharted area. Ah, uh, greenhouse tower. Source of large amount of glass and food supplies. Place of exchange and joint work by the inhabitants of the surrounding islands. Brought here to look after the gardens. Oh, they got like a whole network of things going on here. Who designed this thing? Whoever it was, they weren't big on safety, that's for sure. Be careful, I don't want to fill up all my bottles or I can't take the clean water. Nothing there. Guess we're going up again. Just a brief moment, I thought something was scannable and then... Not that. What are you? Green colander, flora, tool required, knife. Filters water from the air, advised to boil it for consumption. Can't claim that without a knife though, which I apparently can't make yet. Bottle plant oil. Filled with plant-derived oils. All right. Guess I'm gonna be making. Oh, is that gold? Oh, polymer. Epoxy. All right. This place is loaded, man. Don't forget to say hydrated. Psh, hydrated, hydrated. Yeah, I don't have any clean water on me right now. <laughs> I'm sort of hoping I can find a can of water I can drink while I'm up here. Thick creepers. I need a knife to get in there too. Nice if I just found a knife up here. Empty bottle, nice. Just thinking I had to print another one. Uh, window wall requires airship alert. Okay, so I got a window wall I can make now. That might work for those end pieces where I didn't want to put a wall in the way because it would just block my view. This one, I'm either gonna have to get the knife and cut my way in, or actually, it looks like the, probably the only way in, because I don't think even harvesting the glass there is gonna get me in. What do we got? 
garden seeds. One garden per sector is not enough. We need to increase food production somehow, and the cost of rebuilding towers to put up a new garden is too high. We'll try to provide basic resources to the residential towers and leave the rest in their hands. We don't know how they'll get clean water for plants, but we have to start somewhere. There's no other way. Oh, I can research the knife now? Alright. Apparently they were fond of collecting bottles. That's cool. And here, some kind of greenhouse? That's pretty much exactly what this is. Uh, canola multi doit flour. Eating raw is not advisable. A tat. <laughs> Vegetable used in many dishes. Full of potassium. It's a patat. I want a patat. No, I can't collect those things. Interesting. Oh, you make veggie oil and some fries. Yeah, we got... What? The heck was that noise? I don't have a weapon. <laughs> I feel like I need to go research a weapon. Yeah, okay, I'm not going up there. I need to get a weapon before I go up there. Whether it's a knife or a blaster thing, extractor, whatever. I don't care. It's gotta, I gotta have something. <sighs> Done a little bit of inventory too, I guess. Um, another battery. Let's put all these polymers in here. I thought I had a moth left, but I guess not. 15 food, minus 10 energy, minus 10 health. I guess that's if it's uncooked. Yeah. Let's try boiling one. Let's see what happens. I'm getting boiled potatoes. Ooh la la gourmet. Use my teeth. That sounds like a great idea. Ooh, crossbow and bolts. Oh yeah, we're we're making that. We're we're definitely making that. Give me those polymers back. Can't be serious boiling your ammunition. <laughs> Listen. Yes I am. Because my ammunition's both edible and fireable, it's fine. Uh, okay, so the crossbow requires polymer machine parts. Uh, I don't know if I have enough machine parts, actually. Ooh, I don't think I do, actually. Wow. Okay, I can't make the crossbow. That sucks. What about the... Oh, I need a battery. What about the knife? Let's research that sucker. Boiled patat gives 25 food. That's not bad, I guess. Research finalized. Still need polymer here. What do we need a crossbow? There's something up there. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but there's a, it's a, there's a something. Research finalized. Do kids have silver leaf? What? Boiled patat. 25 food minus 5 damage. <laughs> uh, let's do the large bottle, I guess. Printing completed. Okay, I got a knife. Zah! It's not very aggressive, but it's something. I don't think it's gonna keep me alive. I think whatever's up there is gonna murder me. As long as it doesn't make sweet love to my corpse after, I guess. Block with your face, it's good enough. Yeah, that's my normal tactic, I mean. 
If it works any other time, it'll work this time, right? First, I'm going to cut my way into that other room I saw. Yeah, it's a, it's a tiny little knife, but we don't know how big the enemy here is, you know? I, I just heard it making noises, and that was that was enough to bother me. But I don't actually know how big it was. I'm getting biomass off of that. Which I gather I can then turn it into biofuel. Oh shoot, lightning storm. Oh god. I gotta move the ship. I gotta move the oh, actually it's not at the highest point. I wonder if it'll be alright. Oh that hurt. Oh that hurt a lot. Anyway. This thing off of here. Keep it down low so it hits the tower instead of hitting me. Alright. Should be okay down here. Uh, I hurt myself though. <laughs> Where's my medkits? That drop was a bit much. I didn't realize it was gonna hurt that bad. Fuel. Do a little fishing during the storm while we're waiting. Bad video game physics. Bad ah, game. <laughs> I was told side doesn't matter. In my experience, they lie, but it might be luck. Oh, Ashley. <laughs> Go stay in the highest point and see if you can get struck by lightning personally. <laughs> I wonder if I can actually. That, that'd be interesting. Raise. Oh, a fat dust moth. Well, we got a chunky boy. Pick that sucker up. I don't need to avoid lightning. I saw what it did to my ship. I'd really rather not get hit by a bunch of that lightning. That was brutal. It did some good damage. It cost me resources to repair. It was not my favorite thing. Unique insect lures. Canola, multidoid flower, and biomass. So I can't get the canola. I must have to cut it. Because I got the oil, but I didn't get... I didn't get the actual, uh... Canola flower. Filtering bottle. This bottle is equipped with a filter that purifies contaminated water. Oh, I gotta get that colander stuff. More glass, too. Okay. Storm's fast. We can go back up topside. Delicious boiled fat dust moth. Yum. Now we're here. We made it! Give me this thing. So that gives... Wow, 60 food. That's a good chunk. Um, what's my total number here? I actually can't see like a number for my food, can I? Find an overgrown glass house. I'll let my food go down a little bit before I eat that moth. It looks like it's pretty big.
Hey, I got a thing. Yeah, that gives me those. Let's go see what that thing was that was making noise up here. Hopefully whatever it is, it's susceptible to knife. Because I don't have a lot of other things to use. Oh god! Oh god! I don't even know what's attacking me right now! Jesus! What the heck was it? I didn't even see it! Didn't do that much damage, but... God dang, where is it? Oh, there you are! That's a little- Oh no! Oh god, oh god, oh god, I fell. Okay, good. It, was, it wasn't far fall. We're fine, we're fine. Freaked out by little... What thing? Ah, I got you! Oh, a lulling grat cricket. Okay, so I was really worried about a cricket. Okay, that, ow. Okay, note to self. Apparently walking on glass hurts you too. Imagine that, inventory full. Oh crud. Um, let's eat that. Eat that moth. I got too many things on me now. Ink bulb. Fruit with thick multicolored sap can possibly use as a source of paint. In case we want to get all decorative like, I guess. There are all those canola plants. And I wish I'd scan that little insect thing now. Lobster chili? Oh my god, there's all kinds of stuff up here. Okay, I need to, uh, I need to go back to the ship though, because I got full inventory. I gotta unload. I need to make more storage boxes. I hate when they give you storage boxes in a game that only have a couple of slots in them. <laughs> you really need to have more than that. We got so much room to build these things. Oh, I got the vertigo virus. Oh shoot. Uh, database documentation viruses. The vertigo virus. Whoops. Auditory and visible visual hallucinations. Immune system is comprised due to uh, focus on ridding the body of toxins. Therapeutic treatment is potassium. Okay, well I've got that. Causes lulling grass cricket. Yeah the virus to fill the medicine list okay so uh potassium so i have the um i have the patat or whatever we can make it we can make a boiled potato i guess that'll cure us of that that thing boiling uh this filtering bottle i need more glass for that unfortunately i, I gotta make more storage Got to get some potassium. <laughs> What's this? When you wish upon a star, crush. Yeah, I should fly up there. It actually would be easier just to hop off the ship up there instead of like running up and down. Um, what did I finish? It? I printed. There we go. Um, storage box. That in here and play. I gotta do some of this lantern too. Actually, I could probably put the lantern on the ground, right? I can. There we go. Storage box. Uh, oh, sure, we'll put it over here. Why not? A little storage room almost. Okay, this stuff can go in there. Oh, wait. What was the thing I needed to research that had both of those? Oh, that was glass. Yeah, I need more glass. Okay. Oh. 20 food minus 20 energy. It's venom is dangerously stimulating effect on human neural pathways. Oh, that's great. 
Now, where's my potato? Alright, we're cured of that. Darn right, the virus is neutralized. <laughs> my inventory's full again. can't see where I'm going very well with this ship, but we'll, uh, oh, there is an anchor if you actually touch down and stuff. That's cool. I can't see where I'm going very well with this ship, um, but we'll try to get up to the upper level here just by flying. Oh, I can't. Ah, oh, I'm at a max altitude already. Shoot. How am I gonna get the glass from up there? I need that, uh, I need that portable thing I was scanning here, the extractor, but that needs energy crystal, which I still haven't even found yet. I'm gonna have to go on foot. Super tiny storage is the worst ever. Yeah, you end up having to build like a whole pile of them. It's just, uh, it's kind of a pain. I don't mind having multiple storage boxes, but when there's like a bajillion of them and you're trying to find places to put them, that's that gets to be a bit much. Uh, I don't think I needed anything in here. I want that glass. I need that glass, actually. Your immunity is decreasing. Lobster chilies. I wonder if there's like different cooking recipes you can make in this. Like other than like the individual things you boil. Like can you do something other than just boiling, I wonder. Oh, I see you little jerk. Oh, you're you suck! I gotta get something that I can shoot them from range. Bruce flower? Let's <laughs> never go with virus again. Can you cut the grass and pick it up? No, you can't. You can't interact with it. Take poster crossbreeding. <laughs> I says Barton. Use the computer. No power for the computer. Picture of flowers. Okay, so I gotta power up the computer. Inventory full, because those flowers are individual. That's great. Uh, crud. Okay, I'm gonna leave at least one of them behind. Leave a bit of an open inventory spot. This is really dark. <laughs> Someone has a lounge chair up here. I'm like, screw this, I'm not doing all this work. God, the lobster chilies are all individuals, they don't stack either. It's all these plants that don't stack, man. So, yeah, power up the computer. Where's the control? Oh, there it is there. Got it. Flower breeding test results, number 314. The latest breeding shows strong positive reactions to pollution. After a few days of exposure to sulfates, it clearly flourishes. In contrast, it gradually dies in clean atmosphere. Side effect is usual, uh, unusual colors. Still have a lot of testing ahead of us before we can create a plant that purifies the atmosphere. However, we can give a little color to this gray and sad reality. 
Sample location coordinates for the location radar. 40 FO, 3DA, 3DAO, 6677. Oh. Okay, we got a new destination in mind now. So we're gonna make some flowers that can actually purify the air. That's interesting. How am I gonna get this glass? Mm -hmm. I need to do something about my asthma. <laughs> well, yeah, I gotta get the guy to sleep a little bit. I've been uh, running around exploring instead of sleeping, and it's, uh, it's taking its toll. I think. How can I get this thing to go? I, I could make the balloon higher, but I've already got two of these uh, turbine fans on here, and I extended the size of the balloon. <sighs> I could try making the balloon even bigger and see if that gives me enough lift to get up. I've got to rise up high enough to be able to zap the glass. Plus, I got all these stupid plants on me now, taking up all my inventory space. Let's see what happens when we cook the bug. Boiled bug. It's gotta be good. I mean, we ate we ate a boiled moth, so why not boil one of those things, right? We got some sleep balls doing that. Take the battery back? Oh, I probably should, yeah. What? Boiled lulling grass creature. Okay, so... 50 food and 30 energy. Wow. Okay, those things are good. <laughs> we need more of those. Oh. Oh, that's the hallucination thing going on. Uh, I have another patat here somewhere. There it is. I gotta get this, uh... I gotta get this illness cured. Hearing strange things in my head. Just lose weight to rise up higher? Oh. I don't want to disassemble my ship. I don't even know if this game pays attention to that or not. Uh, okay, so the expanded balloon was uh, helium, machine parts, and copper, but I don't think I have enough machine parts for that. I only got eight. I haven't got any for a bit. See, cooking is good. It is good. Wow, 600 watching. Where's the subscribe button on your keyboard? Uh, I don't think there's one on your keyboard so much as there should be a subscribe button located just below the video. All these plants make you think the farming will happen later. I'm almost certain it will, yeah. Uh, okay. We're cured. Again. The virus was neutralized. The virus was neutral. Good. How about that? Can't even stack anything further. I've got... Dude, is this got anything in it? Nice. Okay, I can put a lure in here. That'll free up a spot. Okay, so I can't make another umbrella. Uh, can I put another turbine on this thing? Or not an umbrella. I can't... I, a balloon. I can't put another balloon. My, my brain no worky. Oh, shoot. Where's the turbine? I gotta craft in here, right? Basic turbine. Five machine parts, five electrical parts. I've got those. I thought I had those. Oh, really? I'm out of electrical parts? No, there they are. I got four. <laughs> yeah. Wait, can I make those? Should be able to make those. I can make machine parts, too. Synthetics and copper. I don't have enough synthetics. Alright, I gotta get the synthetics. We're gonna go blast some. 
should do. Out of range. <laughs> okay, maybe it won't. Oh, come on. Everything's out of range here. Be enough. Immunity is decreasing. Diseases might become more severe. Printing completed. <laughs> Does the game have bears or zombies? No, it's got these little bug things so far. I'm gathering there's going to be some other types of uh, hostile critters as well, but I don't, I don't really know what. <clears throat> I'm not sure what to expect yet. I got this poster I can get rid of too. Let's take up space. Oh my god, it's huge. It's just freaking massive. I can't place it outside. <laughs> of course I can. Oh, come on, let me in. I can put it on the ceiling. There we go. There, flowers on the ceiling. What's this thing? Wait a minute. Do we have multiples of the same picture? Nope. That's the uh, crossing and targeted plant reproduction Printing thing. Completed. Okay. Turbine on the back. It's not entirely working here the way I thought it would. There. Maximum flight altitude increased. There. Please tell me that's enough to get me up there now. I just need glass. Nice. Okay, I don't know if I can get all the way up, but at least we can get part of the way up. I got a bunch of glass. Can I get any higher than this? Uh, this is maximum height. I can't even tell what it's trying to target there. It's giving me the marker, but... Alright, I gotta move the ship. The resource gathering is proving to be more of a pain than I thought it would be. You always wanted a mirror on your ceiling. No idea. Yeah, sure. No idea why. <laughs> Thought you could use the knife to collect the glass? Uh, I don't. I don't know. I thought I needed the extractor to get it, but I mean, it seems to be working okay this way. It was just a bit of a nuisance to do this. So I had to build an extra turbine, but I'm getting a lot of glass now.
I should try to get the, um... Wait a minute, did I go down there? I didn't go down to that one, did I? Uh, I should try and go get that battery, too. I'm curious what the deal is with this, if there's anything scannable here. Something sparking there. Where are you? Uh, wrecked upgrade station. Used to be a great device upgrades, improves functionality and efficiency. The tool's battery discharged. Oh no, uh, my tool's toast. How do I fix that? Do I just have to craft a new one? Well, that sucks. I, I think I have to craft a new one. Oh, or wait, or can I just put a battery in it? There's the solid state batteries in here somewhere. No, that didn't work. Nope. Uh, I couldn't lock new blueprints. For How do I? Oh, that battery is toast. Hold on. Nope. What? Now all those batteries are toast. What's going on here? I, I, <laughs> I swapped places with them with the battery, and now the batteries are acting weird. Looks a lot like Subnautica. Same people? Nope. Different people. Um, it has certainly common elements with, with Subnautica, I think, in terms of like a little bit of the feel. Uh, it's also got some, some commonality with a game like Raft, where you're like traveling along and gathering the resources you need to expand. Tool recharger. Oh. Well, I got an upgrade station, but I don't have a tool recharger. Let's uh, let's research this thing. Maybe if I upgrade that tool, it will recharge it. Research finalized. I have to recharge the device or make a new one. Yeah. Uh, okay, so I assume I make it in here. Upgrade station. One motherboard, three transformers, five polymer. I may not have all this stuff. Or any of this stuff. Really? Did I go through all that polymer? I thought I had a whole ton of it. Where did I put it all? I had so much polymer! Did I really use it all? Well, that's a thing I did. Um, can I make polymer in here? Plant oil and synthetics, oh, of course. Give me them synthetics. Grab the battery for the computer, uh, or the smoke detector. What smoke detector? You have to recharge the device to make it. Uh, yeah. So, is there like there's got to be like a recharging station or something then, right? It's like I can't really just drop the battery into it. These batteries are still fine. Gets out and pushes. Yeah. <laughs> not a lot of traction to be had when you're not standing over a tower, though. That's that's problematic. I don't know if you want to try that too much. That was one polymer. Oh boy. Caution. A storm is coming. Oh crap, another storm. How do I make motherboards again? 
Other board is plastic, copper, and circuit board. Copper I have. I don't have any circuit boards. I'm circuit boardless. God dang it. Okay, well I can at least research um, that thing that required this thing here. Oh, it's sitting the wrong plant. Oh, it's rotten! Aw, oh, come on! I didn't use it quick enough. Uh, yeah, you're rotten food. Get out of the tower before I get myself zapped. This is the reference to when the smoke detector would beam through the stream. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I had the same problem with a different smoke detector in my house today. <laughs> I have to order another one. Caught something. Where's my... Oh, it's over here. Dust lettuce. Hooray. Oh, I don't have any water left. Uh, okay. Boil that. I need another one of those uh, water filtration things, or condenser. Oh, I still wanted to build the water catching mm -hmm. thing, too. So instead of the condenser, there's the uh, rainwater collector, but I need one more plastic for that. Or synthetics, of course. <laughs> I'm off by three. <sighs> You're placing the long, uh, long life smoke detectors? Yeah, the ones that we had were supposed to be, like, I don't know, 10 year ones or something. It's funny they both went within such a short time of each other, but I don't know. Uh, my wife ordered replacements already. The ones, the one that went uh, the other day, we already took care of, and then the one today, we just we placed an order for a replacement already. Am I for the USA? No, I'm in uh, I'm in southern Ontario, Canada, actually. I'm a Canuck. Take off, you hooser. Uh, 50 food and 30 energy. Yeah, let's eat that. Get another bug there we can deal with later if we need to. Okay, what was I doing? Uh, I was doing a thing. Oh yeah, plastics. Because I was going to make the rain catcher, right. Seems like that's where resources are alive and you can barely, uh... Get barely an inventory space for tedious. Yeah, it's a bit much. I wish there was uh, I wish there was a larger storage box. Maybe there's one that we can research later as we continue on. But with so many different types of resources to gather, having a limited space to put them in and things that don't stack is uh, it is a bit tedious. I'll give you that. Stick that there. I'm gonna need more one of these synthetic things, so we might as well grab them over here. Oh, sh ah, crap. <laughs> That's why they give you railings in this game. <laughs> uh, that, that, that was not the direction I was supposed to walk in. Just for the record, I just lost like 20% of my resources. <laughs> 
I turned the wrong way. Imagine that. Is Labatt Blue popular? You're both sides. I mean, d define popular. It, it, that's like saying, uh, is, uh, I don't know, I guess if you're in F Florida, like, is Natty Light popular? It's, like, it's popular in the sense that people drink it because it's cheap, but not because they think it's such good beer. <laughs> At least as far as I know. I don't know anybody that, that actively chooses it. Uh, but when I was in university, I would drink it sometimes because it was cheap. I don't think I would call it good. You like Canadian? I'm not really... I'm not, I, don't, I don't really like most of Canadian either. I don't know. I've gotten picky. I, lately, I've been really into wheat beers. So I, uh, I've kind of been favoring those instead. Yeah, I'm going to try to bring the airship in here and hopefully not crash it into so bunch of stuff. I don't know that how successful I'm going to be. Well, I touched down, but it didn't get the, like, anchor thing that said I was anchored. Uh, I need that battery back for the computer. That's why we landed. Put back in here. Back in the days when I drank beer, was Lamat 50 for you? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I mean, we used to, uh... When I was in university, we would eat, like... Oh, you can't get it with a knife. Did you actually gather it or just break it? it? Looks like it just breaks it. I'm not actually harvesting it. Oh, the Bruce flower went bad. Okay, so... Note to self. Stuff, the plants have got to be used pretty soon after you gather them. They don't really last. Uh, there was this beer that, uh, oh, I can't take the battery back. Once it's in there, it's in there. It was, uh, Labatt Ice I used to drink because it was like a higher percentage alcohol beer. So when I was in university, it would take fewer of them to get you drunk. Not a lot fewer, but somewhat fewer. Yeah, but that, again, my priority then wasn't on, like, good beer. It was just on, like, alcohol consumption. <laughs> All right, let's uh, let's get out of here. Where's the way down again? Potato juice, yeah. They used to have uh, they have drink nights at the bar when I was at university. It was like two dollars for a beer, so you could drink quite a bit of it. <laughs> I didn't even like beer at the time. It was just it was it was the cheapest thing you could consume. And so I did. And there was much rejoicing. Uh I don't, let me see what else I got in here that I can research. Nothing really. I, I mean I guess I could do the sticker thing since I already have it party started. Uh we need to go to our next our next point on the map. Research fine. A bunch of those are marked off already. Okay, the next one is uh, off in this direction. 1.52 kilometers. Let's see what we're flying to. It must be... You know that big structure that's way off in the distance there? We'll put on the uh, automated speed management. Let that rip. It looks kind of cool when you're flying over everything in this game. When the sun's out, anyway. It's pretty grim when it's not shining. Have a good night, Ashley. If you haven't already left already. Kind of funny that Americans didn't know what you were talking about when you said a 2 4 may run. <laughs> uh, it's just uh, like local colloquialisms. Can't go wrong with a 2 4. 
Although, actually, I don't even buy beer in that quantity anymore. Usually, if I get some, it's like a couple cans at a time. I'm not much of a drinker. I'm more of a social drinker. Not most viewers use a PC if your PC can't handle something so simple as 1440... What? Most viewers actually... There's a much higher proportion of viewers on YouTube that use uh, cell phones and TVs these days than computers, actually. I think when I looked at the stats, it was uh, it was more heavily weighted in those other two. If you can't handle something so simple as 1440, get a new PC that isn't 10 years old. If you're a streamer making money from your content, then get a new one. Or, James, you could just go somewhere else. If you don't like 1080, ooh, no, it's not. You mean the, those fuzzy uh, cartoon graphics aren't sharp enough? Oh, no. <laughs> Jesus. Get over yourself. I'm gonna go with the orange dot. <laughs> like, I don't I don't know that this game gets much more crisp in 1440 versus what I'm seeing right now. <laughs> it's not this is not high fidelity graphics. Nope, wrong button. Yeah, I'm, I'm uh, descending down to this first tower here. This is one of the um, comms towers, which should have some plastics and stuff on it. Social drinker, streaming social. Have you been using streaming as an excuse to drink more? Shh, quiet, Joseph. It's definitely never, never come into my mind. <laughs> yeah, honestly, when I look at the... the uh, the YouTube stats. It looks like most people are watching on TV or cell phone now versus computer anyway. <laughs> the, the front of this balloon is like sticking way out there. I'm, bugging, I'm just gonna bump it into everything. I, I can't even get close enough here to like make this thing say that it's anchored. <laughs> There we go, now I got it. Ah, oh, airship damage! I landed too hard. <laughs> oh well. This isn't 8k, I'm offended. Alright. I cannot fix the scanner. But I don't think I should ha I should probably shouldn't have anything scannable here anyway. Man, all those plants I gathered just, just all went bad. Every one of them. I should have just cooked them up and ate them right away. Ink bulb. I'm gonna use. I'll cook up the ink bulb. Let's let's see what happens if I do that. Oh man, I gotta get water. Okay, we have. Houston, we have a problem. That's gonna take a while to process. Let it do its thing while we explore. We all need plastics. Do you cook the rotten food? I, I don't know. I, I have a feeling later on there'll be a use for it for like gardening or something. Um, but I don't think it has a use right now. Where's your Baileys? Take one shot. <laughs> uh, I don't have any Baileys on me. I got some Kahlua somewhere. I got some beer in my little uh, my little mini fridge behind me. Oh, fuel. Nice. Your calorie level is decreasing. Oh my god, there's a lot of fuel in here. This was a good stopping point. Oh, well, that was a pointless climb. <laughs> there's nothing up here. Oh god! Oh, almost fell. <laughs> Technically, you're not drinking alone. <laughs> well, when uh, this doesn't qualify as not drinking alone, I'm sorry. <laughs> when I, I have a beer sometimes when I'm streaming, but 
I'm not gonna pretend like I'm- this is not the same as social drinking. <laughs> I mean, I'm still by myself in my basement. Even if people can hear me getting drunk. Zoe says, yeah, you want your money? Well, come find it, cause I don't know where it is, you baloney. Uh, water's ready. Drink, drink, drink. I need water in here too, so let's take a quick drink of that, then we'll boil this sucker up. I need another one of those condensing membranes. It's not pointless, it almost takes you out. <laughs> okay, how's our fuel doing in this thing? Wait a minute, how did I pick up all those cans of fuel and only end up with 15? I wasn't paying attention to the numbers as I picked them up. Like, how small were they? That's ridiculous. Crap, I'm gonna wind up having to make fuel again. Thought I was gonna get a, uh, get a pass for a bit. Oh, there's a purple light out there now. Boiled ink bulb. Uh, plus 10 water, plus 20 health. Well, I guess I could hold on to that for healing, but... It's not going to be terribly useful at the moment. I'll get some altitude here. Holy, look what's going on over here. It's crazy. <laughs> I got beer goggles on, you're doing fine. <laughs> you ever finish your mountain pub in Valheim? Nope, I didn't. I moved on to building in other places. I, I, uh, we stopped playing for a while because uh, I was focused on other survival games, and then the expansion came out for Valheim, and I, I moved on to building in the new areas. Uh, and I haven't really been going back to the mountain too much. Didn't seem worth it. I went there to get some resources. Oh, this thing's damaged. Let's say 93%. That's another bet. Standard wind farm reached. I just ran out of fuel. <laughs> I can get some more helium here, actually, which will be useful for making more fuel. This thing is not in good shape. Somebody hasn't been taking care of these wind turbines. Sit it down gently this time so I don't smash the ship again. There we go. That was better. Oh no! <laughs> Took it back off again. There. Sweet! Uh, I'm gonna fix the ship up while we're here on the ground. It's clearly it needs it. Turbines all ship shape again. Nice. All right, well, it's uh, just after midnight my time, so I'm going to call it for tonight. We'll definitely come back and play some more of this. Uh, Forever Skies comes out on June, June 22nd, which is uh, this coming Thursday. Uh, big thanks again to the developer for providing a key to the game so we can check it out a little bit ahead of time. Uh, I'll probably play it again before Thursday and we'll do a little bit more exploring and see what else we can add onto the ship. Um, there are like ladder bays and everything, so you can make this thing quite big. Might be fun to have like a double wide ship or something with a big cockpit in the center or something. I don't know. 
we got more resources and stuff to gather before we can do a lot of that, though. But uh, thanks so much, everyone, for coming to hang out. Anyone who popped in from Brian's raid, thanks for uh, hanging out uh, with us while we played a little bit of a new game tonight. Uh, thank you for the super chats and everything this evening as well. I'm, as always, Cryptic Fox. I'll see all of you next time.